Welcome back to the channel, it's Gazit. I hope you're all having a fantastic day today. So in today's video, I'm going to be showing you guys and helping you guys build the best DMR14 class that Warzone can offer. So let's get straight into this. So what you need to do is you need to head over to your weapons and you need to head over to the class which you need your DMR on. So for mine, I'm having it on custom class 5 because that's just my personal preference. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to pick the DMR14 which I've done right here and now let's get building into the gunsmith. So you need to be putting on 5 attachments. So the first thing I would start off with is the muzzle and I would always put on the agency silencer. So this is going to give you some sound suppression which is always nice and it's going to give you some damage range so once you have that one on you need to go over to barrel and make your way down to 20.8 so this one right here is kind of a personal preference between 20.8 and 16.3 because one has fire rate and one has a bit more damage so that one's a bit towards whichever your personal preference is but for me i would always go for the more damage because if you get that headshot you might even kill them so 20.8 is going to be the one I'm going to be using for this one. So from here, what I'm going to be picking is the Optic. Now the Optic, the best one here to be picking is the Actual Arms 3x. So this is like a 3x zoom. If you have the 4x, that's absolutely fine. But honestly, the 3x is probably the best one to use for doing the best DMR 14 class inside of Call of Duty Warzone. So once you have the Actual Arm 3 on, you need to make your way over to the Underbarrel. So the underbarrel that we're going to be using for this is the Field Agent Foregrip. You're going to definitely need this. This is going to give you vertical and horizontal recoil control, which you're going to be needing because obviously this is a one-tap gun. It's going to be bouncing around a lot, so definitely have the Field Agent Foregrip on. And the last one that you need to be using is on your ammunition. So what I like to use, I like to use the 30 round speed mag, which is going to give you maximum of your magazine ammo capacity. It's going to give you your reload quickness. Everything around it is just basically ammo related, so it's, you're going to get a lot of ammo. If you're spraying around, let's say it takes about two shots to kill an enemy. If you have all the maximum ammo and there's about four enemies in the area, you don't need to reload. This is probably the best one to be using with all the other attachments that go along with this one. So that is how you build the DMR14 for the best class possible. I hope you guys have enjoyed this video. If this was helped you out in any way, shape or form, make sure you hit that like button. Go downstairs and hit that comment section up. Drop me a little comment of all your thoughts and feelings about this weapon. I have very strong and disliking feelings about this weapon, but I do love it at the same time. So make sure you go down into the comment section and drop that there. Also, if you're not subscribed to this channel, make sure you hit that subscribe button because we're dropping the latest and the greatest Call of Duty Black Ops Cold War, Warzone, Modern Warfare, and Call of Duty number 3000 or whatever game they come out next year. I will be dropping everything. So make sure you hit that subscribe button. I hope to see you guys in the next video. So thanks for watching. I'm Gaz, and I'm out. Peace.